peace and all good things. Today I wanted to share with you probably my favorite passage and writing of St. Francis, which comes from the very beginning of his testament. Where St. Francis writes, The Lord gave me, Brother Francis, thus to begin doing penance in this way. For when I was in sin, it seemed too bitter for me to see lepers. And the Lord himself led me among them, and I showed mercy to them. And when I left them, what had seemed bitter to me was turned into sweetness of soul and body. And afterwards I delayed a little and left the world. I remember visiting Assisi and visiting that place where St. Francis encountered the leper and how St. Francis chose to leave the city where he had everything, his wealth and his family and his friends and his good fun life in order to be among the lepers. And obviously at first this would have been very bitter for him. It would have uh, been a, not the experience that he would have been used to living up in a somewhat wealthy family and in the city of Assisi aspiring to be a knight and now to be among the lepers, those who are outcast by society. It would have certainly been a, a real challenge for him. And yet we hear how the Lord worked in his life. What was bitter for him when he was able to see the world and see the lepers as God sees them became sweet and he felt at home where he delayed a little and then left and lived among them and really left his, his old life behind. Now I think that very oftentimes in our lives we're not going to have this very radical conversion as St. Francis had. We're maybe not going to be missionaries going and living in a, a far off land where we're going to be ministering to people as much as St. Francis ministered to the leper. But I think that in each and every one of our lives we have bitter places. We have those people, those situations, perhaps even in our own family and friends. We don't maybe don't have to go very far. But we have bitterness, where we have bitterness, where we are not able to see God and we're not able to see our brothers and sisters as truly uh, a child of God and as a person which God has given to us as the Lord gave me brothers that the Lord has given me these people so that I may love and that I may see God and grow closer to him so I think that each and every one of us in our lives again maybe not as radically as St. Francis but we can ask ourselves, what are those bitter places in our lives? Those places where we cannot see God in others. And let us ask God for the grace as he gave St. Francis, uh, as we see in the Testament, that we may allow God to turn that bitterness into sweetness and that we're gonna be able to see God in everything, including those places where we feel as though he's absent. And in doing so, that can change our life, and that can bring us closer to him and make us into a more loving, charitable person and can truly change the way that we view our lives in our world.